What's happening, my people? It's your boy, Biba King of the Attic Collectibles of More and Collectors and Nostalgic Universe. Today, I'm showing you guys this showcase I've had here forever that I could not do nothing with. I finally had one of my vendor's friend named Ron cut me plexiglass shelves for it. When I first got the showcase, it came with glass shelves that were not the right size, so I never could really uh, fully utilize this... Uh, this display case but now I do so I took all of the Pokemon stuff out of a four foot six foot showcase because it was pretty much overwhelming it as it as what as it was and now all the Pokemon stuff is in here so it's four-sided so you can see all the way around I have stuff on every side so you can see all the Pokemon items now, I have been recently eliminating things out of my personal collection, so quite a few of these new items in here came from my collection, and I'm still eliminating some things out of my personal collection, so if you like collectibles, you definitely want to stay tuned to whatever uh, page or site you're using to see this video, because I have a lot of awesome things in my collection, and what I'm getting rid of are things you probably won't find anywhere else. So, that's that case. This is the case that the Pokemon items used to be in, so I took all of the Nintendo games and I put them in this case. So now you can see the Nintendo NES, Super Nintendo, and Nintendo 64 games a lot better. They're more visible. There's also tons of uh, Nintendo collectibles in the showcase as well. Stickers, figures, shirt pins, games. Uh, there's a few Switch games up top there. We have the um, video game related collectibles on the top of the showcase as well. The showcase behind it also has a bunch of video game collectibles. There are more up here on the top of this showcase, this spinning showcase. So we got those there for you. And then over here, there are more in here also. Uh, collectibles, this is like the rest of the collectible stuff. There's PSP stuff up there. This shelf is all GameCube, Wii U. Top shelf is all Nintendo Wii. Um, just heads up, the Shikan boxes are not for sale. Those are from my personal collection. I just thought they'd be cool to bring them in here and show you guys. Especially because I have these limited edition Shikan the Forever Man action figures here. And this one glows in the dark play as, ooh, look at that. Nobody else really has these in the area. I think I'm the only store that has these figures. So, that's the new setup I've been working on today. I'm still working on more stuff in here. If you guys haven't been in in a while, you definitely want to come check it out because you know how I do it. The store has been completely rearranged in several areas. I'm not going to do a long video right now, but I will just show you this area up here has already changed several times. Since I rearranged it, uh, I don't even know when I rearranged it, two, three weeks ago. But it's changed multiple times since then. Um, I'm working on more things here too. Oh, let me show you this cool picture real fast. Check this out. Look at those beautiful animals. That, that picture is $20 if you're interested in it. It's a really big picture. It's nice. Um, but more changes are coming, more furniture is coming. I actually have a cool, a couple cool pieces of furniture out front right now trying to draw people into the store. I'm working really hard to get uh, more furniture into the store. We're still working on, um, we're redoing some furniture in the back room. It's a time consuming process, so I apologize we haven't gotten much out yet. But it is coming. It just takes time to, you know, work on them and get them to where we want them to be. So you guys can come check them out and hopefully be interested and buy them. Um, I've got this cool picture here. I've been trying to do some research on this picture, but I can't find anything. And we got this cool sailboat one too. That picture is like $10, I believe it is. It's a nice picture, canvas style. So that's going to wrap it up for this video, everybody. As always, I appreciate you guys for checking out the store. Coming in, keeping me company, giving me encouragement. Uh, all the compliments you guys give the store and to me, I really appreciate it. It gives me more motivation and drive to keep going. 
because I'm going to be honest, Barberton is a tough area to make it in. It's hard for us to get anybody to come here. It's been really thinned out lately. There like, has been nobody in the store the past couple months. Sales are terrible, to be quite honest, and uh, we need to make some sales here to keep going. So, as always, I appreciate you guys, and we'll see you on the next video. Peace out, players.